Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back to the channel, y'all. Melanie Gemini, Mystic Tarot, back at you guys again. So let's come in, let's come in. Thank you for coming in. Thank you for your likes, your shares, your subscribes. Y'all, let's get into the energy. I gave you a lot of protection for y'all as well as everyone that's coming in here. I appreciate everybody for their likes, their shares, their subscribe, and everything they do for this channel. Thank you and welcome newcomers because here I've been seeing the numbers go up. Moving forward, y'all, I'm trying to see. I'm going to get into this retrograde deck because we're still in retrograde eclipses and all of this old extra shit. So let's see what's going on in this reading that we need to know. Let's see what's going on. Thank you guys for your God and our angels. We need the energy of the collective. Let us be clear to the audience. What is going on? I'm already feeling frustration. Someone's frustrated right now. Okay, y'all. I'm getting money in abundance, y'all. Automatically, money in abundance is coming out, y'all. Don't do that, y'all. Money in abundance. I know money in abundance is coming, y'all. It's like I'm nowhere when everything feels like it's hectic. And it's out of whack. It's coming. I know someone probably was um praying to God and asking um you know to show reassurance. Naomi and Nehemiah, if I ask y'all to not do what you're doing, we gonna have a whole problem. So when I say what I say, I say what I say. Moving forward, y'all. Y'all probably doing with them. Y'all can wait. Sit and talk and forgive. Somebody probably sitting, talking, and forgiving. Maybe something to do with money and abundance. Then I'm getting heartbroken. Somebody is heartbroken. Somebody is heartbroken about wanting to sit and talk to someone and wanting someone to forgive them. Then I'm getting it was a good. Thing. This is not a sure thing. It was a good thing and not a sure thing, y'all. Something to do with money. Somebody chose money in abundance with someone else when the other person was supposed to be with was supposed to get to that point. Nehemiah, get on that bed and lay down. Because I told you not to play with me. Get on that bed now. And see in those little feet and those little legs on that bed. Thank you and Brian for giving me. Don't play with me. Find you some other energy that's going to allow you to do that. Moving forward, it was a good thing and not a sure thing. Someone thought that they were doing something good. It was, it was, they thought they were getting away with it. It was going good, but it wasn't a sure thing. You're probably just having to talk to people having a constant talk to them about things and, and then it's like when, 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 when you made the boundary known you probably got to it somebody was running wild is right here running wild somebody was running wild and someone needed to sit talk and forgive or want someone to sit talk and forgive or you were heartbroken and now they want to sit talk and forgive because you separated yourself putting your foot down like i said Somebody is putting their foot down and they're putting boundaries down because they're not playing. Moving forward, then I'm getting bitten, partner. This, okay, <clears throat> so a bitten partner realized that this person was a good thing and not a sure thing, and that all this other person wanted was money. What I'm getting Gemini never allow others constant excuses. Someone's running wild and got constant excuses that you just really ain't trying to hear no more. Let me get one more card out of here. When I'm getting bound and confused, someone put their foot down and now somebody is down and confused because you probably told them either you're going to keep doing this and I'm going to be gone or you straighten up and you can work on it. Moving forward, y'all. Moving forward. Uh, 
five on the clock. The change is coming. The change is coming, y'all. Y'all know I hear y'all. Y'all know y'all. Y'all are not quiet at all. I hear y'all know y'all making the ground shift, right? Y'all know y'all running wild, right? I can hear y'all. I can hear the snickering. I can hear the laughing. I can hear y'all thrusting all over the floor and moving sporadically. So you're not really just listening to me. Really, you're saying that you're going to do whatever you want to do to me. But see, I need it like that. <clears throat> you can talk whisper, talk to Nathan. Let's get this to y'all. Nobody, y'all. Uh, just notification. Here for y'all. Let me get some messages, y'all. If you're going on, if you need to know what's going on in your reading, what needs to come out, what needs to be said. Shit is going down with your job. Either shit's going down with your job or shit went down with your job. Moving forward. <laughs> it says, reevaluate, change your perspective for fucking shit. <clears throat> Moving forward. So make that make sense. <laughs> so someone's probably reevaluating something at work. Either reevaluate, change it up, or quit. Then I'm getting you. Don't talk to anyone. Don't look at anyone. It says you need some fucking time alone. And you know why. So someone needs time alone. Someone doesn't want to speak to somebody. Someone doesn't want to talk. Somebody's doing some type of way. Then I'm getting fucked in this. It says it will lie to your face. So people that people want to fuck you real life to your face if you do what they want, move it for. Or they will lie on your face, like I say, to do what they want. Moving forward, you are going through some tough shit right now. So Gemini is maybe going through some tough shit, but it's not going to last. Everyone has their time welcome and their time alone. Moving forward, you are going through some tough shit right now. So Gemini is maybe going through some tough shit, but it's not going to last. Everyone has their time welcome to your gather because everyone has their time. Welcome to your gather your tired ass up and handle it. So you are going through a tough time. Y'all, we getting it done. Trust me. Then I'm getting love. Get some, give, get some, get some. It will chill your ass up. Love. Someone probably ain't talking to somebody right now. They don't feel like being fucked with talk to none of that. They don't even feel like being looked at. Just put a little love in your heart and take time to understand the situation and honestly understand the situation that you thought you had been in. Moving forward, you're going to be fucking apologize. Seriously, just do it. Someone needs to fucking apologize. Then it was like, eat the fucking vegetables. Eat some shit made by Mother Nature. Moving forward, believe what you see. Face reality or live in fucking La La Land. Choose bravely. If somebody is living in La La Land with a love relationship, someone is living in La La Land because they don't think that they're doing and hurting other people. Then I'm getting detox. Drink a smoothie, unfriend that asshole, and throw some shit out. So y'all, I know I've been doing that. I know I've been drinking my, my food, eating my food. I've been around here, you know, freshening up my area to make room for blessings that I am and I'm feeling that I'm knowing that I'm getting to. Moving forward, time to let go. So someone needs to let go of things that serve them no purpose. Someone needs to let go of a love relationship, friends, family, and it, 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 it could be friends, family, you know what I'm saying? Relationship, any of that, anything that is a person and another person together that creates a relationship, y'all. All I'm saying is believe what okay. Believe what believe what you see from these people. Stop being in La La Land, damn it. 
time to label up things, like I say, that don't serve no purpose or these people that serve them no purpose. If they keep making you be in a weird situation, leave it so you can win. You're going to lose if you keep being with people who, you know, they don't understand it. You need a good fucking cry. Someone need a fucking cry. Get the ugly cry on. Let that shit go. Your soul will thank you later. Trust and believe that. I'm going to do one more card and then we're going to go into another deck, y'all. It says, get some fucking sleep. You are big and ass because you are fucking tired. Face the pillow now. <laughs> So someone probably gonna look at this late night, I promise you, and they gonna be like, wow. After you look at this message, you need to go to sleep, because this is probably what you needed to go to sleep, y'all. Let's get into another deck. This one is a love oracle card. Tarot deck clarification and completion theme. So I guess we're gonna do this one. <laughs> This is the wheel of the year, too. So I really only got into this one time, but let's see what's going on. You know, what, what comes out? Let's see what comes out. And then we're going to get into the Zodiac card to see who it is about, who it can be about. Period. So moving forward. Let's see what's going on. You guys see about an all the angels and the ancestors to be clear to a woman for all the messages. There it goes. But if you know it, I mean, I just kind of like things are going on everywhere. They kind of fix things and it's coming hard, but it's not going to be coming out. We are going to come. What do you guys see about an all the ancestors? Come on out. I'm getting the five of cups. Somebody is crying over spilled milk, or somebody is upset over something. Somebody may even be upset about their garden, or something may, someone may have messed up their garden because they knew that was what they loved, 1244 on the clock, y'all. Or something to do about somebody. Um, whatever someone was building, someone feels like it, it was a waste of time or so, something somebody was doing was destroyed. Or someone tried to destroy something or did try to destroy something because there's something you cared about. And if you're being it, there's something that you care about and they destroy it, it's going to break you down, but it's not. It's going to build you back up even stronger. Y'all, then I'm getting a, a pinnacle. Somebody is working on their money. After someone tried to destroy something in your life, you're starting to work on your money now. You're starting to work on something that's going to make you money. And it just seems like there's a Sagittarius that's hating on you. It's the fact that you're working hard. You really just don't have time to talk. And they probably drive a dark car or they're a dark skinned person. Then I'm getting the world you are working towards things that are going to bring fulfillment to your life and there's these hate man people that's in the background just watching what you're doing because they, they just trying to watch they just look in the face and just over the shoulder ass y'all then i'm getting king of pentacles so a king of pentacles or an earth sign sabotage something or change some something in some in a uh, a Gemini's life. So you're working hard and you're getting the world. Let me see what that. And whoever this was, this King of Pentacles, he was just all about money. He was materialistic. He, you know what I'm saying? Look good, had money, had you know what I'm saying? Eating good, you know what I'm saying? But he thought that's all it was. He thought that he had made a person and he didn't. See, you work hard. 
you see these other people around, you work from the bottom. Moving forward, when I'm getting the five of pentacles, somebody feels left out in the cold. Somebody feels like, why is y'all doing that? Moving forward, so um, moving forward, it's like a five of pentacles. So with the five of pentacles, I think somebody came in and try to destroy something in whatever you had going on. And somebody's telling me that their birthday wasn't was August 5th, Gemini, or their birthday was on the 10th, or somebody's birthday was on the 13th, or somebody's birthday was on the 18th. Y'all, I keep getting 18. Remember, in every reading, I get the five of pentacles. I get the eight of pentacles. So somebody... So somebody is working hard after being left in the cold. Somebody being, somebody is working hard and being self-disciplined and, and being, and I'm telling you, somebody is being self-disciplined to the remembrance of things that went bad in their life. Someone's telling me that somebody locked somebody out in the motherfucking rain and threw all their stuff outside. I'm getting an energy of someone trying to destroy something in your life in some type of way. Um, you know, you're trying to come back up. And they're trying to figure out how in the hell did you come back up and they had you in a binding, compromising situation. Because it was God. It, it, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They don't understand. Like, they're not in control of things. Then I'm giving you. And all I know is you're getting the world and you're going to be abundant. You're going to be, you're going to be cheating. You're going to be abundant. Someone is telling me that someone is getting the idea to grow their own fruits and vegetables. Probably grapes, apples. I'm, I'm seeing olives in here too, y'all. You seeing olives in here? I'm seeing great vines, y'all. When I say your harvest is coming, right now you may have some stuff around you that you're trying to sell or you're trying to get more sales, and it's coming, y'all. And then I'm getting the 10, you getting the 10 of 10 of, of the 10 of 10 of the world. So whoever this earth sign is, they try to do some weird shit to you. Now they money, they, they try, their karma is them having a fucked up judgment. They ain't gonna be happy with nobody. Everybody gonna want some for money because they try to do that to you. You get what you put out. Moving forward, y'all. And then I'm getting two of um the two of uh two, this is two of cups. Yeah, so this is the two of cups right here. Somebody left you out in the cold for somebody else. You see this? They left you out in the cold to be with somebody else and or marry somebody else. Hmm. And then I'm getting face of one. So you're getting a lot of abundance. This is the ace of wands, y'all. You're getting a lot of abundance. You're getting a lot of opportunities. You're getting a lot of things coming your way because honestly, you never did anything to anyone for them to ever do you in a fucked up man. You always put out good energy. 1844 on the clock. Confirmation. Then I'm getting uh, so this is the prince. Why are you saying this? Moving forward, this is the prince. This one is like the prince. Moving forward, something is telling me something about that you're going to find that. You're going to find balance in love. You're going to find harmony. Something about outside, too. Moving forward. You have opportunities coming. There may be somebody coming your way as well. The person that is coming towards you is supposed to be for you. If somebody turns it on to another a message I'm getting, somebody turn their back on a ten of pentacles with somebody that was toxic. You turn your back on a Virgo. You can't get back in the real thing. 
y'all then i'm getting the empress somebody had two lovers too i'm getting that the empress is getting opportunity Y'all be woke, y'all stay aware. Something going on. Something going on about this empress. They birthday may be in March. Or the birthday birthday may be on the 18th. I'm keep on getting 18, y'all. Somebody is turning their back. Or somebody's trying to stab somebody in their back as they leave. Or somebody's trying to fuck you off. And then you turn your back or something like this. When I'm getting two of swords, somebody fighting over a woman. Somebody is fighting over a girl. Somebody is fighting over a woman. That's the secret. Somebody fighting over a woman or a man. And ain't nobody on the channel is going to be fighting over no woman or no man. Trust me, believe that she's right there. Yes, you need a choice. Then I'm getting, you're getting 10, y'all. 10 of wands. Someone is almost towards the place. Maybe someone's eating watermelon hats and eating watermelon on the hot days. Somebody is getting towards the place. Y'all look at the, the meaning of watermelon and the spiritual meaning of watermelon. Something to decide before somebody is coming their back. That someone is walking away. That somebody won awards and what wounded warriors. Another thing I'm doing about this side before is that somebody has been working hard and left. And we went towards common form because it was too much backstabbing. It's too much people saying this and saying that. Then I'm getting the seven. The seven is finalized. Wow, what is this name? This is going to be the seven of cups. Somebody is getting something. Somebody's transformation is bringing them money. Y'all, and then I'm getting for a penalty. Somebody is being stingy. Somebody is being selfish. Somebody is being stingy and selfish towards their lovers. Somebody left towards a woman or somebody left towards a man to get towards common waters and now they realize they're being selfish and stingy. I'm getting ten of four. Somebody feels bad in the back. There's something about ten of plays. It's an intuition. It's something, it's something going on or there's an ending to something, y'all. There's an ending to something. We went in the retail, we went to another deck. Pentacles. 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 Some people getting together is going to be a gathering. I guess some money is going to come. I think it's going to be on the 9th of August or the 9th of September. Or in September, if you're looking for money to come. I'm going to hurt someone from the moving for it. Anyway, let's get into another bag. 
Right now, thinking about what they ate today. Hmm. I don't know where the fuck they came from, but it did. You guys did. I don't know. I'm just gonna mess with this. It's delicious. It's there. The chaser. Chaser and codependent relationships. Fear of abandonment issues. If someone is having abandonment issues, someone is chasing because they don't want to feel like. They doing like it was when they was young, doing left and shit. It says mask, not showing two feelings, hiding. Hide, it says. It says mask, not showing two feelings, hide. First, beside persons. Person pretending. So if someone is pretending to be something they're not, someone is doing it. Someone is codependent and being something they're not because they want to be left alone. They don't want to be alone or they don't know how to be alone. Y'all, then I'm getting sadness, missing you, thinking about you, yelling, unsure of future. So someone is in separation. And someone wears this mask like everything's okay, but they really, and honestly, they want to be with you. They're trying to chase you because they don't want to be with nobody else. But they keep doing you fucked up and you're tired of that shit. You're tired of the game. You want me to be real. Then we're getting golden mirror, self absorbed, narcissist, one side of relationship, love on me. So y'all are dealing with someone, y'all chasing somebody. That's self-absorbed. It's a self-absorbed narcissist. It's a one. It's a one-sided relationship. And if you love bombing you, even if you be love bombing you, or be oh, it's hot air. And after you pop it, it's nothing in there. Mm -hmm. I'm getting. Ending, dreaming, new beginnings, growth, change. Um, yeah, so growth and change is coming. There's going to be an ending. There's going to be an ending. There's masks coming off. Someone is getting exposed. You're getting turned flame. This is the unity of the game. This is, I guess, this is, this is your twin. This is your twin flame. You're separated, and there's separation between you and your twin flame, but somebody not acting right. Moving forward, uh, Moving forward, then I'm getting past them. And same chemistry like each other equally have fun. But y'all dealing with this person, they self absorbed this passion is sex. You know what I'm saying? You running after a self absorbed narcissist and all of this is really sex. Just be honest. It can be an ending for those people. Huh? There isn't any or is coming to an ending to that. And this is your twin flame. Your twin flame is like you, but it's something that you need to learn from you so you can move forward. But honestly, your twin flame, y'all are supposed to have a contract but they fucked it up because they're so scared of you being like the other. Moving forward, girl talk, time with your with friends, moving on, happily single, living in the moment, having fun. So someone ended a relationship with someone, you with your girls, you chilling out, you living in the moment, and you having fun. When I'm getting happiness, expansion, joy, playfulness, oneness, enjoying each other. So this is what y'all use, like this is paradise. You have their separation between your twin flames and you were their paradise. And they didn't realize that until you were gone. Now you you know, you giving yourself self love. You took you know what I'm saying, the mask came off on this person. 
And now you and your, you know what I'm saying? You and your own happiness, you ain't supposed to be about it. Thirty on the clock. Y'all didn't get in karmic relationship. Hmm? Told you. It was a karmic relationship. Bleeding, bleeding, triggering, turmoil, resentment. There's a lot of resentment in this relationship. There's a lot of lessons in this relationship. Didn't I tell you your um twin flame had to teach you something? Didn't I tell y'all? Didn't I tell y'all? Moving forward, letting go and loving you. No one wants to let go and love you, but honestly, it just seems like it be the same thing over and over again. But y'all talk about it now. I don't know. If somebody loves you, they just seem like it's go back to the same way. Who wants to be in a situation like that? That's confusing as hell. I don't like being by myself so I can make my own decisions. I don't like just making decisions. Um, and I'm getting unconditional love. Self love, woman, passion, affection. So, like I say, like you're giving yourself unconditional love, you're giving yourself that love, though. You're giving yourself that affection that, that you didn't give to yourself, which is making you more attractive. And then it says, keep this arrow in reverse. So, when someone is not having faith, Love is not coming. They think that this is going to come to them. Surprise, invitation, or meeting and hesitation. If someone is hesitating in meeting, or you're hesitating in meeting with someone, please don't go. Because honestly, you cut the cords on this shit. You know we're going to continuously do the same thing over and over and over and over and over again. So y'all, moving forward. Let's get into who this can be. Who is this talking about? Who is self-absorbed? Who is narcissistic? All of that, y'all. Y'all know I'm doing it. I'm talking to you. I'm going to call you to make it to me. So they don't mind me. They don't mind. They don't want to come out. Don't you guys feel that in that thing? It's so difficult to get this thing done. Y'all would have came to y'all on my own at work. I forgot my cards in there, y'all. I promise you I did. I was just going to live without them. I was going to talk 32, 32 in the front. Don't you guys feel that in my thing? Who can these people be? Don't you guys feel that in my angel? Who can these people be? An Aries. A fire sign. Your birthday probably on the first. Saturn. You got Saturn. Or they got Aries and Saturn. Or something like that in their chart. I'm getting... I'm getting January 9th. I'm getting 119. Somebody's looking at something to see how it's going to pan out. Something's going on on the own team. I'm getting a Sagittarius, y'all. Something to do with a Sagittarius. Nine. Something is coming into play. Communication. A desire. Damn, this is in here. All right. Someone's manifesting. Someone's manifesting something, like I said. Somebody's manifesting something. If someone has maybe eight in their birthday, 88, 89, 98. Born in 88, 99, 89. Aquarius. So it's an Aries, Aquarius, Sagittarius. Who else can be? Earth sign, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. Birthday could be on the second or the sixth of an earth sign month. Or it can be September 2nd, September 12th. January 12th, January 2nd, January 6th. 
February 11. So 2 11.